What's up, Knuckle Up? So here we go again. So today we're going to cover phases five and phase six of the land method. So defense against that front kick and defense against that big old haymaker punch with that right. So basically, I'm going to take Brad and we're going to go ahead and show you what I'm talking about. I'm going to move Brad to this side so you can see more or less what I'm doing here. Now basically, if we're in this conversation stance here and Brad was to throw a front kick, all I'm looking to do is hit out at the kneecap. Now in the book, it tells me to hit one leg and shoot to the other, but that doesn't make any sense because the minute I go one and two, Brad's gonna hit me right in my face. I'm leaving this whole thing open by doing this. So what I did was I went ahead and took the whole low high principle of this one, and I went ahead and went for the collarbone instead. So basically, one, two. Now this is gonna prevent him from throwing that strike. And even if he throws it, I'm gonna guard it with this hand as I'm hitting him. So I figured out the basic for this one is, instead of going one, two here, and getting hit in the face, your best bet is one, two. Go right for that collarbone again. So that was phase five. Phase six is pretty much defense against somebody throwing a big old right haymaker. So again, if I see that Brad shifted as he is here, he's already in a fighting stance, I'm in my conversation in my land method stance here, and he throws that big right, I'm gonna shift off to the side here, I'm gonna hit his arm, and I'm gonna go roll now for that kneecap and then retract. So again, Brad throws it, one, two, and then once again retract. So very, very basic, there you have it. Phase five, defense against the kick, one, two. Phase six, defense against a right, one, two. And there you have it. Those basic five, I mean about phases five and phases six out of the land method. Let me know what you think.